F. I want you to jump, jump, jump. <laughs> Yee guys, welcome back to another episode of IBP Cribs. We are in the biggest foam brick mansion ever made. Yee guys! You guys absolutely smashed the like button on the last overnight. Over 15,000 likes. So you know what that means. We gotta stay overnight in a trampoline park. And not just any trampoline park, the biggest one in, in the world. world. Oink, oink. Oh, you hear that? Oink, oink, oink. Boink, boink. It sounds like that? a cow. Boink, boink, what? Boink. Is that a cow? Oh! Oh shoot! Zane. Zane's back! Boink. Boink. Hashtag return of Zane. We got everyone back on the track. We got your boy Ricky. We got Nick right here. And we got your boy Zane back. <laughs> the original overnight crew is currently 10 o'clock. They close at 12. So we're gonna get in there. Big shout out to the owner Ty. He's actually letting us do this, but not all of the employees know that we're staying overnight. So we gotta go in there, hide in the foam pit for the next two hours and hopefully we can make this happen without any of the other employees that don't know we're staying overnight. We are inside to infinity and the owner that we know let us up in this special room so we're in here. We're gonna go down and hide in the foam pit and then hide from the employees that don't know that we're actually staying in the night. If they do, well, they're not because you know, we're stealthy, you know. We're gonna be building an obstacle course and we're gonna be building the world's biggest foam brick fort. Guys, this thing's gonna be massive. It's gonna have so much furniture in it and we're gonna bring you on a full on IBP Cribs tour. This is the temporary crib, but later after we build that foam brick fort, it's gonna go next level. You already know five diamonds. We're gonna go in the foam and jump in there right now. Let's go guys. Sneaky, sneaky. Employees are cleaning up. We got our boy Chase and Zach, who are the employees that are gonna stay overnight with us. We got Nick over here and we got Zane over there. So we just gotta wait in here until all the other employees who don't know that we're staying overnight leave. And then Chase and Zach are gonna tell us that we're clear and we're just gonna have the whole trampoline place to ourselves. It's 1.31 right now. All the employees have left except for the four that are staying with us. Shoot, there he goes. Zach just texted me. He said, come out, we're clear. So we're gonna head out of here. Yee yee! Guys, let's go. Zach just texted me, the lights are coming on. Boom! Ooh. There's Nick coming We're out. We're in here all alone. Yeah. Ninja Nick's still bulling back there trying to get out. Look at this hoodlum. Yee -yee! Big shout out to Zach for helping us get in here and the boys. He actually has a YouTube channel. It's Moto Zach, M-O-T-O-Z-A-C-H. Shout out to him because without Zach and the boys back here, Luke and Chase, we would not be able to do this. I can't believe this. We're staying overnight in trampoline park. We have this whole place to ourselves. So we decided to make the best obstacle course. The loser of the obstacle course that we make has to put on these giant boxing gloves and get pelted with dodgeballs. So Nick's gonna explain what the obstacle course is. You start right here, you run through this little gauntlet. Then you climb up here, hop this fence, run towards the stairs, then up the stairs. Once you get to the top, you have to touch the wall. You can use this or you can just go die for it. If you use this, you can bring it in closer to you 
and then you can get more distance. Jump off, touch the wall. Once you touch the wall, you're gonna run, bounce on this trampoline onto this platform. Bounce off, and now down the warp wall and up the warp wall. Once you get to the top, you're gonna run from here all the way to the basketball hoops. Straight shot as fast as you can. except you're actually gonna dunk it. And the clock doesn't stop until you dunk it. So I'm gonna go first, slowest time loses. Ready, set, go! Ooh, he's going quick, he's going quick. Ooh. Touch the wall, touch the wall. We touched it. Run for the dog, run for the dog, run for the dog! No. Oh, he missed! Now break your legs. Break them. Break, break your em. legs. Break them. He missed, he has to try again. He lost the ball, he lost the ball. Miss! Oh, he got it. Final time, 55.8 seconds. Cost me at the end, I missed the dunk, man. How do you feel? I'm hoping that that doesn't bite me in the butt. Zane is gonna go up next and see if he can beat my time. We got Ninja Nick on the timer right here. On your marks, get set, go. Oh, Zane Ninja. Oh, he fell. Oh, snap. Oh, caught him. Up the stairs, pretty fast. Oh, he goes straight in. He got that leaping ability. Touches. Can he get out? Oh, shoot. What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> he slipped. Oh, he missed. Oh, he's stuck. Can he do it? Oh, he got it. Oh, third time's a charm. Big boys ain't going up. Oh, he missed you. Zane costing time. Oh. No! Come on, dude! Third try. Oh, one more! Come on! That boing? No! I'm gonna dunk it for him. Got it in for him. 156.24. Zane over here, how do you feel, dude? Tired. <laughs> He's tired. <laughs> Shoot, the warp off. That's what messed him up, man. He did this one for his mom, though. <laughs> he did this one for his mom, bro. That's good. That's cute. <laughs> Ninja Nick is gonna go up next. He just has to beat Zane's time of 156. On your marks. Get set. Go. There's Ninja Nick. Oh, quick. They call him Ninja Nick for a reason. Is he gonna go for the jump? Oh, he just goes straight. What the heck? Is he gonna go for the jump? Oh, he just goes straight. What the heck? Costing some time for the boy. He lost the head mount. He lost the head mount. Touches the wall quick, though. Up the warp wall. First try, Ninja Nick doesn't mess around. Now he's gotta go dunk it. Oh! Oh shoot. Oh shoot, he takes the shortcut. Shortcut, no one even saw this besides Ninja Nick. Going on top. Two hops. No! Oh, he missed! Dude, this could cost him. Oh, he dunks it, what time? 103. 103! Dude, you came in second. The miss dunk cost you big time. 103, eight seconds behind the big boy. You could say he's a little bit cheesed. You happy with that run? No! You won it first? Yes! You know his motto, refuse to lose, and he just took second. If you're not first, you're last in his mind. Let's go interview him. Get How do you feel about that run? Face. Get that camera out of my face. Okay, okay. Get it out of my face. All right. We're gonna go in this dodgeball cage and all Zane has to defend himself with is those giant boxing gloves and all of us, the workers, including Zach, are just gonna throw the balls at him. <clears throat> Employees only? Savage. Oh! Grab him, boys.
Yeah. You ready for this? You ready for this? Yes. You ready? Yeah. What? Ready for this? Yeah. Ready? Zach and Ben are competing to see who gets to throw at Zane with us. Whoever throws harder, you guys be the judge in the comments. Zach's going first. Weak sauce. All right, all right. Judge in the comments. Now Ben's going. One throw. You only get one throw. Oh! Oh! I don't even know if that's a question. Hit the like button right now if you think Ben did it. Comment if you think Zach did it. Either way, hit the like button. Either way. Okay, guys. Who, who won? Ben, that's what I thought. I, I saw a lot of likes on that, so Ben's gonna throw with us, and Zach, the pro cameraman, is gonna record. All three of us get 30 seconds to throw as many of these balls as we can at Zane because he lost. How do you feel right now? Untouchable. What's your last words? I'm untouchable. Untouchable? Yeah. That's how you feel? Yeah. What's your plan once they hit you? I sit down, think about my life choices. <laughs> okay, you heard it best. Three, two, one. Go! I feel bad, dude. I feel bad. 23 seconds. 23, come on. That was seven. Dude, I do feel bad, dude. I feel like a horrible human being. Hey, hey, hey. 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 What, what, what happened? Did the gloves slip? Did, what, did your feet yeah, the slip? slip? Yeah, you see this? Yeah, they're too small. Yeah, they're too small. Gloves. That's why, that's why. <laughs> and All right, guys, we feel super bad for Zane. This is the world's biggest trampoline park, and we're going to build the world's biggest foam brick fort. I know you guys have been waiting for it, so we're going to start building it right now. We got all this empty land right here to construct an IBP mansion, so let's go. Hey! <laughs> Gotta go from zero diamonds to five diamonds real quick. You excited? Yeah, very excited. Very excited, says Zane. We got a little system going down. I'm in the foam pit. I'm throwing the blocks up to Zane. And Zane's handing them to Nick, and Nick's making sure the wall is super steady. We've been working on this thing for about an hour now, and we still got a long way to go, but once it's done, it's gonna be super cool. It is currently 4.38 in the morning. We've been doing this for probably like two hours now. And look at the progress. This side's pretty low, but this side's looking stacked. Back here, it's looking good. Zane is jiggling that rope real nice, making sure the rope is nice and jiggled. It has to stay jiggled. It's currently 6.14 in the morning right now, and we've been building this fort for over two hours for you guys, so make sure you guys smash that like button on this video. Big shout out to Fan of the Week, Jose Martinez. If you guys wanna win Fan of the Week, all you have to do is follow us on our Instagrams and show us some love, guys. We put so much effort in this. We've been doing this all night. Finally, it's come together. This is gonna be the biggest IBP Cribs tour ever. Guys, welcome back to another episode of IBP Cribs. Today, we are in the biggest foam brick mansion and the biggest trampoline park ever. Follow me in, follow me in. All right, so on the right, we got two beds right here. These are super soft. Get the quality of that Tempur-Pedic, boy. Quality Tempur-Pedic. It's soft, man. And then you come over here, we got the nice guardrail. This thing is super sturdy, guys. Very sturdy, it almost never falls. You come up, we have two stories up here. You come up to the second story, and you can do whatever you want. Casually fall. Get back up. Come through here. Watch your step, um, there's something, something gonna fall. We got the smiley face right here, because you always gotta stay positive. No matter what you're going through, stay positive and believe that you can achieve anything. Right here, we got the orange seat and the blue seat right here. Ooh, okay. Come okay. through here. We got Zanester. Oh, Zane, what are you playing? There's My not Xbox. even a good... He's playing the Xbox? Oh, okay. Got the big boy Xbox right here. And then over here, we got stacks of water. For any time you're thirsty, just take a sip. It, it just rehydrates you, especially when you're playing video games. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, here, here, sip, you have some. Sip. Let the, let Yee Nation have some. There you go, guys. Ooh, Hope ooh, you enjoy good that water, water. Good water. And look at this, guys. 
This took over two and a half hours to make. Make sure you smash the like button for this. We put in so much time. If this got destroyed, it would honestly just be such a heartbreak, guys. I couldn't even imagine. What? What? Nick, what are you doing? Dude, what are you doing, bro? I need to win the obstacle course. I shouldn't have lost. Oh my, Ninja Nick is going on a payback. Rampage. Oh my, Ninja Nick. What the heck, bro? This is, this is hours in the making, dude. And Ninja Nick's taking that one second. Not the Xbox, dude. Zane's still playing over there. No bricks must be left behind. I should have won the obstacle course. I refuse to lose. No! No! <sighs> no one can stop me. Refuse to lose. As he disappears in the foam into the abyss, Ninja Nick. Just destroyed. You can't even tell what's the foam pit and what's not. Oh my gosh, all this is gone. <gasps> Nick said he wouldn't leave any bricks behind, but look what I see here. I see a few bricks, boy. Oh shoot, oh shoot. No, 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 no. IBP Cribs was literally probably the best crib ever made. That's the most time we've ever put into an IBP crib. And look at the place now. Look at to infinity. It is just a banging mess, man. One thing I've learned is do not mess with Ninja Nick, especially after he loses something. 6.20 in the morning, the place opens up in an hour and a half. So I don't think we're gonna sleep at all. We're just gonna go run around this whole park. Cause how many times do you have a whole trampoline park to yourself? We gotta make the most of every opportunity and just have as much fun as we can. Hey. We call this next segment, Nick in a ball. Dude, look like he broke his leg. <laughs> Nick is already in the big gopher ball. I'm about to go in one. We're just gonna charge at each other with these balls and see what happens. There's big boy Zane on the track again. Yes, sir. All right, go on. <laughs> He's being born right now. The natural birth process. Uh, that, that was that was good. It feels good to win because you know, you know, happened last time when I lost. You know, <gasps> don't even get me started. <clears throat> but I won this time, so it's okay. It's more than okay. It's like, oh, right. oh, 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 oh. oh. He took the dub on me, but I think he just took the L right there. Man, this was one of the most fun nights ever. We'll see you guys in the morning when the place opens back up. Hey, it's time to hop up. Hi. Oh. How are you guys? I know you heard us knocking. She we, told you. We didn't know if we were allowed to because it was just strangers. Yeah. Stranger danger. Yeah. We need a gun. I can go. The coolers. So basically. There's supposed to be a fitness class right now. We didn't even know that happened. We still have to clean up everything. It is currently 8-11 and we gotta start cleaning this place up before it opens to people that wanna jump on the trampolines. It's early in the morning. They just opened back up for those people to go exercise. So we're gonna head out. Successful overnight. We got home and we took a thick nap. 
and thank you to everyone who's still watching right now you guys are the reason we hit 300k and speaking of 300k we have a 300k special coming next week where things might get a little bit spicy <sighs> If you guys want to see more overnight challenges or you want us to go back to the trampoline park, let's smash 25k likes. Oi, oi, oi. Comment down below what you want to see us do next time at the trampoline park. And until next time, yee yee! Zane is a magician. Watch this trick. There he is. Where is he now? That is the porthole to Narnia.